Hi, and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a super easy and inexpensive Valentine's DIY for you. I'm real excited to share with you. Um, I think you'll find it's really sweet and um, really simple. And so without further ado, I'm going to get right into it. So the items that you'll need for this DIY are two dish towels that I got mine at Target um, at the dollar spot. They were $3. A package of cotton balls for $1.88 that I got at Walmart. Pencil, ruler, scissors, and some fabric glue. And I spent about 3 or $4 on that. But if you already have that, you, you don't even have to spend the money on that if you already have it on hand. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this dish towel and I'm going to kind of eyeball what size I want it to be. I want the heart that says you and me in the middle. So I'm going to do that right now. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to follow the natural folds that are in the dish towel. And that's how I'm going to measure how big I want it to be. So I'm going to take this and I'm going to cut along this line here where I folded it and folded these hearts under here. I'm going to cut along that line. Okay, so I just cut straight across. And it doesn't really matter that the line is uh, frayed because we're going to be um, kind of tucking the edges under. So now I'm going to take this side and I'm going to kind of just eyeball it about the same about the same size and cut that. Okay, I decided not to eyeball it and I decided instead to measure it from the uh, widest part out and then I had measured it from the widest part down here. So hopefully that's gonna make it um, even. Well, we'll see. Okay, so I see right here where my fold is and I'm going to come over to this side and I'm going to try to match that in length. Okay, so now I'm going to apply a small bead of the fabric glue along the bottom here. And I'm going to just um, flip this up like that a little bit. Okay, so I have applied my fabric glue and it is run right along the edges there on the side. And now I'm going to do the top piece. And then I'm going to take my cotton balls and I'm going to put lay them in the center of what's going to be my pillow. And then I folded each side in and secured it with fabric glue, both on the sides and along the edges. So as you can see, I'm still going to fill in a little bit with the fabric glue, but I've got a pretty decent seam here. And then here at the top, I still have where you can see my cotton balls. So I'm going to just kind of push those down a little bit, maybe poof it up a little bit, get it where I want it, and then I'll seal the top piece. And there you have it, a cute little Valentine's pillow that you can use as a decoration. I'm going to take the other dish towel now, this one, and I'll be doing the same thing. I won't be filming it but because you've already seen how I've done it, but um, I'll be doing this one too. And here are the finished pillows. This was such a fun, easy project. It cost me $4.88. The second pillow took me a half an hour to do. I was not filming, so I was better able to keep track of time. Two little uh, bits of information that you're going to want to know. The first is you do not want to overfill these pillows with cotton balls. The second is that when using the fabric glue that's going to take the longest so you're going to have to have some patience in waiting for that to dry. I also had to go back over and kind of fill in some areas that had come up undone or didn't adhere properly. I don't know maybe it's the fabric glue I'm using um, or maybe that's normal, I'm not sure. But I'm not really a, uh, uh, let's see, I'm, I'm not the biggest craft person in the world. This was real easy for me to do. 
and I have two cute Valentine's pillows that I can use to decorate for Valentine's Day. I hope you've enjoyed watching this video. If you have, please subscribe to my channel. I have one more Valentine's DIY to do. I also do shopping videos, and I plan to do some more DIYs in the future. I don't have a regular schedule yet for posting, but I'm hoping to get there soon. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video, and I hope you have a blessed week.